Hey guys, Soup Zero here, and today I have some good news for you guys. My Roblox executor called Xfinity is finally unpatched. So yeah, here it is, version 1.0.5. It has a brand new UI, as you guys can tell. And yeah, so far only the main API works. The uh, the um, secondary one which uses easy exploits does not work but easy exploits isn't the greatest anyway so i'm not too worried about that but uh the main one does work so yeah in today's video i'm going to show you how to download this and how to navigate through the new the new ui it has some new features and yeah let's get into it Okay, so once you complete the two simple steps, you'll see something like this at xfinity.zip and obviously you want to hit download and make sure before you download this to turn off, to completely turn off your antivirus because it will, the antivirus will think it's a, it has a virus in it, but it doesn't, it, it just thinks it does. So go, go ahead and click download on this. So once you have completed the download, you'll see xfinity.zip in the bottom left corner of your screen. So what you want to do is you want to grab it and bring it onto your desktop, just like this. And then you want to right click it and hit extract to xfinity. Let's do it do its thing and then you can go ahead and you can go ahead and delete your zip file and here is the xfinity file. All you do now is just double click it to open it, open this, and then hit Xfinity 2, and then here's your, here's Xfinity. It's version 1.0.5, like I said, it has a brand new UI. So now I'm going to show you guys how to navigate through this new UI, and as well as the new things I added onto the new UI. Okay, so I'm in the game Mortal Mystery 2 to sh to show you guys how this new UI works. You can do any game if you want. So yeah, here it is, and let's let's start with the basics. This in inject button is obviously how you inject this. So so you want to go ahead and click that first, and wait for it, it to do its thing. Once it's said it's loaded down here, you want to then into your script. Actually, no. You want to hit. You want to hit this eraser button. What this does is it, it clears what whatever's in your script box. So you hit clear, and then you want to go ahead and paste in your script. I'm using a Mortal Mystery 2 script. And so once you have have your script pasted in, you can go ahead and click this play button. This play button is the execute button. So hit that and then you can hit minimize and then open up the script and here is the script obviously you can do no clip whatever you want to do i already showcase showcase the script so i'm not going to go too much into this into this gui so yeah next is you can uh, you can save your, your script on a file on your desktop if you want pretty nice oh no 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 I'm sorry this is to open a script from your from your um, desktop sorry about that and I just died so yeah and uh, this this symbol with the number two is the alternate executor this one uses easy exploits API but I don't recommend using this one because first it doesn't work and secondly, when it does work, it's it's trash to be honest. So that's why you want to stick with this one. So next is this download save button, and what this does is once you hit it, this GUI will pop up, and you can add, you can save your you can save your script that you put in your script box onto this list box right here. So you can. So say if I want to save this Mortal Mystery 2 script, all I do is is give it a name. I'm gonna do MM2. Oops, MM2. And then you head down to this drop down menu and choose your 
file type, I'm going to do .txt and then you hit save script and it pops up on your list box and if I haven't told you guys already I did add a list box which is pretty nice then we can close this and then we're gonna, I'm going to hit clear and then I'm going to right click my Motorola Mystery 2 script and it gives you three options you can load to the uh, script box let's hit that loads it or you can directly execute the script by clicking this or if a script isn't showing up on the list box you can just hit refresh list box and yeah guys it's pretty nice again if you want to download this I'll have a link for it in the description below so yeah if you guys enjoyed this video please hit the subscribe button it helps me out a lot and like the video and join my discord server to get updates really cool updates like this and i'll see you guys in the next one